Hello, I'm John Kinalopoulos from Athens, Greece, eye surgeon based in Laser Vision Center here and clinical professor of ophthalmology at NYU Medical School in New York. As a transplant surgeon, I've uh, developed an interest in uh, cornea transplantation keratoconus over the last 20 years, and we've um, evolved the uh, cross-linking technology to apply it in uh, early keratoconus and potentially resolve the problem. Regardless of whether it's early diagnosis of keratoconus, whether it's establishment of its potential progression, or evaluation in postoperative results utilizing collagen cross-linking or our signature Athens protocol, criteria, in our opinion, are very vague. We still use the amsler krumai criteria, uh, which uh, we tried in this paper, which is a great amount of work. In this paper, we evaluated an exuberant number of keratoconus patients and tried to correlate the corrected visual acuity in these patients, the keratometry, the pachymetry, and most importantly, what we found may be the earliest flag, the earliest red light of keratoconus, the topometric indices provided by uh, the Pentacan uh, uh, tomography. So Seinfeld tomography uh, in its current version can uh, uh, give us data on basically symmetry of the cornea, and these are called on this technology the uh, topometric indices. Uh, we found that the most sensitive appeared to be the ISV, the index of surface variance, and the IHD, the index of height decentration. And we also found in this very uh, big study that corrected visual acuity and cornea thickness were very, very poorly correlated to the degree of keratoconus and the establishment of its progression. So uh, pay attention to this paper. We feel uh, this paper creates a new benchmark in uh, the way we evaluate keratoconus. Uh, I'll try and briefly go through it, but uh, the data is so much that I would encourage you uh, to study the details of the paper, each little graph uh, on this uh, uh, evaluation of hundreds of keratoconic cases uh, within our uh, clinical application here in Greece. I hope you find this presentation interesting, and I thank you very much for your attention. So you can see here the scatter plots of uh, corrected distance visual acuity in regard to the degree of keratoconus. Uh, and we found a very poor correlate on corrected visual acuity and uncorrected visual acuity for that same reason with a degree of keratoconus in these young keratoconic patients we studied in Greece. So as a uh, uh, comment of caution, uh, visual acuity can be very deceiving in us judging whether there is a keratoconus there and its significance. Here you can see the very strong correlate of the IHD and the ISV with the degree of keratoconus and very poor correlate of uh, corrected visual acuity and pachymetry. Um, again, very strong correlate here to the different types, uh, stages of keratoconus uh, with the topometric indices, um, which we feel are the most sensitive tool in diagnosing keratoconus. So in essence, as uh, radical as it may sound, and as a paradigm change, we think the importance is in the topometric indices. I hope you found this presentation interesting and I thank you very much for your attention.